Mr. Sharp. Now, this is about property tax, right? Now, we have people who have been in charge, mayor and executive, and is property tax only bad this year? No, for decades, right? So why aren't these plans already into effect? It's very simple what we can do. There's a problem with property tax is you don't vote on it. Your legislators do. So unfunded mandates come in. That's how we said the unfunded mandates come in. A, a county is now strapped with paying 89% of its budget on some that Albany or D.C. says so. Now they have no, no way of making money. The legislators go in the back room, declare an emergency or a crisis, and then raise your property tax 9%. But what if instead the law changed and you simply had you on November on the ballot, would you like your property tax raised 9%? You don't say no. That would stop property tax being raised. That simple. It's a simple plan. We can stop it right there. The most important thing, though, is, as you said, fixing Medicaid and also fixing our schooling. I don't want to just cut taxes. That shifts the burden. I want to lower spending. We do that. We win. Thank you.